Hey guys, this is Akash Patel. I am going to show you that how to record an audio in iOS using AV Player. So here we are. I have just created a view with three buttons in it. Uh, I am just uh, I have just provided an action with three buttons that start record, stop record, and button play. So okay, there is an issue with button play. So I am just creating an action again. okay so simply i have created three buttons only with the action method and in dot h file view controller dot h we are going to uh, define the two variables name av audio recorder and av player but uh, before all that we have to import the av foundation kit and av kit here so we are going to do that Here it is av foundation dot h av kit okay so we have just created the global variables for av player and recorder so by that uh, we can record an audio and after the, that recording we can play the audio so in vcontroller.m now first of all we are going to define a path in button start record once the button is clicked for start recording then we are path is then path will be defined We just simply name it as path so here we are providing some objects uh, which will be required for the recording purpose recording an audio so the first object will be ns search path for dictionary so ns search path for this name here it is now we are here uh, three arguments so we are going to provide the ns document dictionary here first document directory then domain mask it will be user domain mask and here we are providing the boolean value years after that we are going to okay here we have to get the last object of the path so we have written it then here second as a second argument we have to provide a name that uh, at which name the recorded audio file will be saved in the directory so I am going to provide as a my recording dot m 4a this is a format for recorded with recorded audio file so please kindly note that that recorded format will be uh, define the format of that uh, audio now uh, path is decided uh, now we are going to generate an url which will in indicate a path We are going to provide the path here okay now we are ready with the url now for the recording purpose we have to create one session we will call it a audio session so just go for it audio session we are going to just initialize it now for that session we have to set the category so session then set category 
here in category we have to provide the audio category so it will be as a play and record audio category AV audio session here it is play and record and we are going to provide a nail for the error so I'm going to tell you that uh, when you are using this in your project then kindly handle the errors for the demo purpose I'm going to just show you the video I'm not going to handle any errors right now but please you know that you have to uh, handle the errors now the session has generated now for the setting purpose we have to create one uh, dictionary which will generate uh, which will contain the key and uh, value pair so for that ns dictionary ns mutable dictionary we will name it as a setting okay. uh, here we are just going to initialize the mutable dictionary after initialization we will input the uh, key and value pair for the recording purpose so here setting sorry okay setting set value for key of uh, our first value will be the ns uh, number uh, which will uh, for the key format id uh, like we have to provide a format id to recording purpose so here it is the value will be as a this number with integer here we are going to provide the format mpg4 mpg4 double ac sorry for the late I'm just trying to find the yes here it is so uh, the key will be AV format key okay now another value will be set value for key here we are going to set the hertz value at which rate the audio will be recorded so just this will be the float value and the sample rate key the last value will be the one for the channel number so number of channels key here we are just going to provide the ns number with integer so that uh, it will be easy 
not everything did. Yes. So we have done with the setting. So now just simply start the recorder. Uh, before that recorder, we have to provide the setting for the recorder. So the recorder name, recorder will be AV audio recorder. We are going to initialize with it. Uh, initialize it with the setting we have just created. So in it with URL. Uh, the URL will be the URL that we generated at very starting, which contains the path. So that will be the URL here. URL. Now settings we have just generated a dictionary. So that setting and again we are going to we are not going to handle any errors right now before all that recorder dot metering enable you should set as a true or yes so that uh, metering will be enabled by default it will be a disable now just simply two line code recorder prepare to record and the recorder record So by clicking on this button start record uh, it will start the record now we have to code for the stop record uh, so just uh, for that recorder and stop but here not stop here we are not stopping but we have to close the session also so we are going to close the session session and uh, set active we will provide no yes. and for the error we are going to write as nil okay so we have just completed with the coding part uh, start record and stop record but we are not going to identify that record is actually record the video audio or not so for that we are going to play the recorded file so here we are going to code for that in button play uh, we have already declared a av player so player player will be play the audio so player av player We are going to initialize it with uh, URL. Uh, which URL we are going to pass it here? That recorder URL. So recorder dot URL, which will be the URL at which the recorder file is stored. And uh, simply player play. Okay. But uh, before all this, uh, we are going to write little bit code that if recorder is not recording any audio then only we are going to play an audio with our AV player okay simply cut and paste this statement in the inner side of if loop okay so here we are completed with the we are going to run it from file So I am going to start a simple sample audio that you will come to know that record uh, recording is actually start or not. So after clicking the start, I am going to play this. Okay, I am stopping the recording here. Now just simply play it. <laughs> 